Hello everyone, this is Gary with your cards of the day. And today I'm going to be using three rather interesting card decks. I'm using the Power of the Runes deck. I'm using the Druid Animal Oracle by Philip and Stephanie Cargon, which is illustrated by the wonderful Will Worthington. And I'm also using the Ogham Celtic Oracle, which is illustrated by Peter uh, Prankonik. Very difficult surname to pronounce. And I'm going to focus mainly on the cards today, um, although I may also put up a little note about the numerology of the day, and it'll be interesting to see, blind in a sense, how the two work together. So moving to our first card today, we have the rune, which is at the bottom, of Win, sometimes called Wunjo. And what we have here is a very, very happy uh, rune. This Win or Wunjo means joy. So the feeling here is, is a very joyful one. It is one of... Um, in a sense, having the opportunity to have a good time. This seems particularly uh, appropriate for a lot of us with this in the UK being a bank holiday. Uh, we have a bank holiday Monday. So this could well be a time for letting our hair down, um, enjoying ourselves, having a great time, spending time with friends or with family or with people we just enjoy being around, really. And even though this, I mean, this does have very much have the, the look of a celebration uh, and a sort of a gathering. I mean, there could be elements of that as well. But this really does feel more like I'm just getting this idea of have a good time today. Enjoy yourself. Do things that you enjoy doing and try to have a really good time doing it. It's nice when a, a rune comes up that really just says, let your hair down, have a great time. Now, the animal that we have for today is fox. And this is very interesting because we have three influences in this card. We have the fox himself. We have the reeds, which are down here. And we have the holly, which is here. Actually, we have a fourth, because we do have a sunrise here as well, which I'm being very, very strongly drawn to. The fox is very clever. It's very cunning. It's very intelligent. It knows its limitations. It knows what it can do and what it can't do, and it is very, very crafty. Now, the reed in the Oem, the reed is very much about... Uh, time of being able to move things forward but here what I'm drawn to is the fact that the reed is actually frozen so what I would say is this is be cautious in pushing things forward you've got the resources and the strength and the ability which is what Holly is lending us here but it's something you have to be careful with just like the fox stepping out onto the ice it has to be very careful where it steps and how so, do be aware that if you want to move things forward today, you're going to have to do it carefully, in a very considered manner, and be, be cautious and be cunning in any sort of forward movement that you make today. And our final card, these, I have to say, rather huge cards, but I do like large-scale decks, is... Ash. Now the symbol from the Oem is there. And what we have here is a card of interconnectedness. We have a almost a sacred geometry kind of symbol here. And what this is basically saying to us is remember that we are all connected to the web of life. So everything that we do or don't do, every action or reaction that we make has consequences not only for ourselves but for others 
around us as well. So just be aware of that. Be conscious, be mindful of your actions and how they may affect other people today. So, if we have a look at the card spread as a whole, it's very interesting. We start out with an indication that we've got a very, very joyous day. We've got the opportunity to have fun, have a good time, and enjoy ourselves. We do, however, have to be cautious about any actions that we take today, anything we try to push forward. There is optimism, which is what I was getting from the sunrise. I didn't actually cover that in the card, but I do feel there's optimism around the day. But we do need to be cautious and cunning and a little bit careful. And that is supported here with Ash because this is saying, be aware that your actions affect others. We're all part of the web of life. We all affect each other. And so be aware of that and be careful in what you do and how you do it and be mindful of its, its wider effect. So I hope you've enjoyed these cards of the day and this rather interesting sort of Norse Celtic look at the energies around us. As always, please feel free to leave me some comments and let me know how these themes interacted with your day today. And who knows, perhaps tell me in what way the fox showed itself in your dealings today. Please also feel free to check out my website, www.theseerscave.webs.com, for more information about myself, my tools, and the readings that I offer. I want to wish everyone a really joyous, happy, successful, and interesting day today, as I do feel it will be. And love, light, blessings, and frith to you all.